Welcome to the glamorous world of aviation maintenance. Forget luxury lounges and champagne. Today, we are preparing for a Boeing 777 wing tank entry. At the first, the control unit of the refuel valve has to be removed from outside. Removing it requires the patience of a saint and tools that haven't changed size since the 1950s. The tank is purged, sniffed, and certified safe. It is time to find a hero willing to squeeze in. This is where we learn the true meaning of confined space. It's tight, it's dark. And the technician has all the graceful mobility of a walrus in a wetsuit. They're basically spelunking for safety, navigating a maze of tubes and spars to reach the prize, the faulty refuel system. And with a sigh of relief, our technician emerges, blinking into the light. If our mechanic can't fit into a certain corner of the tank, which is often the case, we deploy the inspection camera, essentially a high-tech snake cam. It's our eyes where our head won't go, ensuring every rivet is inspected and every piece of foreign object debris is spotted. Now for the grand finale, the leak check. The access panel is sealed up. We pump the fuel back in and wait. If we see a single bead of Jet A fuel where it shouldn't be, it's back into the tank for the whole crew. We're aiming for airtight perfection. If it doesn't leak, they sign the paperwork and get to go home. If it does leak, well, somebody's ordering a very sad late-night pizza. The Boeing 777's fuel system is designed for high capacity, long-haul flights, with tanks that can hold over 181,000 litres. Its pressure refueling system can refuel the aircraft in under 45 minutes. And there you have it. Just another day ensuring a multi-million dollar machine doesn't spring a leak at 40,000 feet. It's tough, it's technical, and yes, it involves crawling into small spaces. But thanks to these dedicated maintainers, the next time you're flying, you can be sure your fuel is staying exactly where it should be. Fly safe, fly dry.